Hi viewers, welcome to today's episode. Um, it's this nice rainy uh, day in January 2016 and we're going to talk about kale today. I'm going to let you see what I grow in the greenhouse which is my kale seedlings. As you can see they are starting to sprout. These are about two weeks old but as you can see most of my um, plants that I plant in my vegetables are grown by seedlings if I possibly can and if I can't find them then I usually will buy them in these packets over at the nurseries but today we're gonna talk about kale and as you can see this is a beefy kale variety that I have right here and this has been pretty successful for me as you can see they've started sprouting and I've already transplanted a few in the garden so we'll go check that out right now so here we are uh, we're headed to the garden area and open this door here and as you can see I will show you some of the kale that I just recently transplanted and they are right here. So these are transplanted about three days ago and they seem to be doing pretty good in this area. But right now it's like the best time to do the kale. Um, it's January here in the Central Valley and the cold weather actually is good for the kale. But as you can see, I have more kale on this side and this is the dinosaur kale as you can see here this is the leafy kale and on the other bed here is the red Russian kale so we are going to pick some of this um, I'm going to show you how I pick it usually the way you pick the red Russian is I go from the base as you can see I've already broke some off from previous harvests but all you do is break it from the bottom as you can see how it snaps and there you go and that is the red Russian kale so one thing I love about this uh, red Russian is it's not only delicious um, as it gets colder as you can see the stem it's like a purple. You figure it'd be red, but it's purple. But it actually gets pretty sweeter. Um, it's more flavorful in the winter time than in the spring. But the other thing I like about it is it's fancy leaves. And I will show you because um, I'd like to intermix this with my uh, kale in the front. So let's go head over to the front. So here we are in the front, and as you can see, you can see the kale, the red Russian kale here, and right next to it is the ornamental kale. This is a white flowering kale, but this is the one I don't eat, um, but it looks pretty, but it complements the two. And so why not plant edibles also in the front? So there you go. Um, hope you enjoy the video, and we'll see you next time.